A nationally acclaimed high school principal is standing by a new dress code she created not for students, but actually for their parents. Carlotta Outley Brown is the principal of James Madison High School in Houston, Texas. And earlier this month, she issued new rules for parents after one mother allegedly showed up at the school wearing a head wrap and T-shirt dress. Omar Villafranca is outside the school. Omar, good morning. Good morning. And just to be clear, the parental dress code only applies for this school. It's not district wide. And the policy says that attire that is, quote, totally unacceptable, unacceptable for a school setting will get parents kicked off campus. Now, some people like the new rules. Other people say it just really dresses down parents. The roughly 1600 students at James Madison High School already follow a dress code. No hoodies, no flip flops and no low hanging pants. Teachers and staff also must look neat and clean and dress appropriately. Now, similar expectations have been set for parents like Tamiko Miller. This is a failing school. You have other things to worry about than my attire. This month, Principal Carlotta Outley Brown issued a letter telling parents they would be blocked from campus if they wore satin caps or bonnets, shower caps, hair rollers, pajamas, torn jeans showing lots of skin, and uncovered leggings. Also forbidden? low cut tops, sagging pants, undershirts, short shorts, and dresses that reveal the derriere. You are your child's first teacher, Outley Brown wrote. We must have high standards. I did feel a little almost insulted, but if you're just coming to that school or you get a call and you're working out and you run up to the school, I really don't feel that we should, you know, punish parents for, for trying to be involved in doing the right thing. At least that parent is at the school. The letter was sent after this woman told a local TV station the high school turned her away because of her outfit. She said that my headscarf was out of dress code and my dress was too short. Principal Outley Brown has been repeatedly honored for her work as an educator. You're an amazing woman. In 2015, Ellen DeGeneres presented her with a $100,000 check in part for a homeless outreach program Outley Brown established at her previous school. Ellen, my children, can you hear me? Yes, I can. Are the most important thing to me. They are the most important thing, and if they need me, I am there. Outley Brown implemented a parental dress code at that school too, which won a National Blue Ribbon Award from the U.S. Education Department in 2008. Some people have even compared this to, she's coming in like Morgan Freeman and Lean On Me. Do whatever you have to to transform and transmogrify this school. I believe that she cares or she wouldn't be at that school. Let's hear the plan for taking care of the academic standards. Then perhaps let's say, you know what, you know, moms and dads, can we maybe up the ante a little bit? I really don't know a parent that would have a problem with that if it's, if it's going to help. Brown and the district would not talk to us on camera, but it's worth noting that Brown is actually a 1979 graduate of Madison High School and said becoming principal was her lifelong dream. Anthony. Omar, thank you. I, th I don't know how I feel about that dress code. <laughs> it's like, I know. I, it's pretty strong in some ways. I mean, look, for a lot of people, it's, it's hard just getting everybody out the door. And yeah, no, I know. Not, let alone getting dressed yourself, yeah, you know, I mean, especially I, if you have lots of kids. I like what the woman said at the end. It's like, we, just ask parents to, you know, up the ante a little bit, right? Mm -hmm.